A family in Horry County wants answers and they also want justice tonight. They want to find the person responsible for the loss of one of their pets. ABC 15's Gianna Forbes shows us what happened to the dog and what the family now wants. He was awesome. Uh, he was so, he was such a good boy. He, we called him a trick master because he'd jump our six foot fence when he was a puppy. Joanne Leister is talking about one of her family dogs named Ace when he was a happy and healthy puppy. He and the other two family dogs got out of the home in the Carolina Lake subdivision off of Highway 544 early Sunday morning, but Ace never made it back home. Uh, it was devastating because the whole time we're driving around looking for him all day, you just hope that he's going to run across the road. After calling Horry County Police, Tracy and Joanne started to search, holding out hope that their good boy Ace would come back home. We got people on four wheelers. We got the whole neighborhood looking that we know up and down the roads. The search would come to an end later Sunday evening when the Leisters received a call from a man two streets down the road. I get a phone call about 518 from a guy over on Gravely Shore says, uh, you have a dog named Ace. I said, yes. You found him? He goes, I did, sir. But the call wasn't good news. The man who found Ace discovered him here at this pond. And when they pulled him out, they discovered that he'd been shot twice. Ace was chipped and had a collar with Tracy's phone number on the back of it. They never expected it would be used for this call. He says, no, I just fished him out of the pond behind my house on Gravely Shore. The person responsible for killing Ace has not yet been found, but the family has a message for them. How can you be so cruel? And I just hope justice can be served. That was Gianna Forbes reporting. If you have any information about what happened to Ace, you're urged to contact Horry County Police.